After Dallas dominated the New York Giants with a 49-17 victory on Sunday afternoon, star edge rusher Micah Parsons took to the virtual streets, aka X, formerly known as Twitter, to drop a couple of cryptic messages. This came after he didn't record a tackle or a sack in the impressive win and made a swift exit during post-game media availability. His first post read, I ain't been this speechless in a long time. Following a post from Sam Williams, Parsons responded with a free me then, reacting to Williams saying there's no need to free him. When questioned about any frustration Parsons might have experienced on Sunday, defensive coordinator Dan Quinn mentioned that Parsons' competitive fire sometimes fueled his emotions as he aimed to have a more significant impact on the dominating win. Isn't that any competitor, right? You always want to make an impact, and sometimes his impact is creating chances for others due to the attention he draws, Quinn explained. Any competitor can get frustrated by that. There have been games like that, and there will be more like that. Parsons had just come off a game in Philadelphia where he racked up 9 tackles and 1.5 sacks. However, against the Giants, it marked his first game of the season without a tackle or sack as New York focused on neutralizing Parsons. I think it's hard, Quinn remarked. It's hard for anybody to be in that space because what you're capable of is exceptional. When someone is trying to say that you will not ruin the game, that can be hard for any competitor. There are times where it's easier to deal with and times where it's not. Yesterday was one of those where I imagine it was harder. Even though he was the focus on the defensive line, Parsons found success in coverage during the 10 snaps he played as a true linebacker. One highlight was when he cut off an opening across the middle, taking advantage of a J. Ron Curse blitz on third down, resulting in Giants quarterback Tommy DeVito not making a throw. That'd be a good example of him dropping in coverage when the protection is coming to him, Quinn explained. You see how that could be an advantage for sliding all the protection to you when you're actually dropping. You do have to do that from time to time to make sure that a team is not putting all of the time and attention on him. It's not always the easiest thing, but it is the best thing for the team, and that's why we do it.